Okay, this is RT seven four nine one two six eight. Tran, I couldn't really tell whether you were trying to get near the cooling tower of the of this uh, machine, or whether you wanted me to get near this um, braided part of the machine that we have here. Um, I don't know that I see much in the way of bulging. Um, we do see them in the, like, like this piece here is a little bit out of line. It looks like it could have warmed up and bulged and then maybe shrank back or something. Um, so anyways, that's 7491268. Here we have 7628787. Again, we're near that braided piece. You'll see they're not exactly in a straight line uh, here. Uh, those transistors could be loose. They, they feel a little bit loose. They feel like they could have swollen up and come back down. The same with these three that are on this side of the motherboard surrounding the memory. Also, over here, on the other side of the slot, underneath this um, strange little device that uh, Dell made to hold peripherals, these seem to be a little bit out of kilter as well. Um, as to which one is causing the failure, I don't know if it's this one underneath this fan. Um, again, exact same model, you know, you'll see that this is the larger tower, this is a tower but a little smaller, and this is a 280 um, that came back in. This is the one where Task Manager is gone. It has a straight OS issue. As soon as the .NET framework was installed, Task Manager is gone. As far as swelling, um, take a look at this line down by where the RAM is. I haven't touched these until right now. That one feels pretty solid in place. I don't know if they're normally out of kilter like that, but I can't imagine why a manufacturer would deliberately stagger them, you know, a sixteenth of an inch. Might have something to do with the way the board's made. I don't know. From what I was able to look up on the internet, it just seemed that um, these particular Dell machines had a high, high failure rate. Um, but what we experienced isn't what the norm. We, ex we didn't experience the USB boards going and other peripherals. We experienced operating systems failing. So here's your two returns. They'll be packaged up and sent out today. Um, um, the uh, RMA 629-129, RMA 629-130. We'll get these folded back up nice and easy. You'll see that we have them marked. I was going to put them both in the same box. Erica Price asked me not to, so they'll go in different boxes. And I guess I won't do that until I have two hands to do that with. We would appreciate an RMA to be issued for machine number 7756279. Uh, these are Redemp Deck machines, and these are three failed Dell machines. Um, you have all my contact information. Feel free to call me. And yes, I did look to see whether or not that switch had anything to do with uh, a failure. It did not. As a matter of fact, that switch was deactivated on that machine. Thanks a lot. God bless.